Greetings, you too. Danny Staten here on the Daily Dan blog. I'm on an investigation where a rescue squad driver on his way to an emergency. Lights are flashing and siren roaring. Said he saw several large creatures cross the road in front of him. Five to ten. Several. They ran into the woods. He called my brother. My brother called me. And here I am a few hours later. On the scene of the investigation. If you watch my first video, I tracked the creatures through the woods. All the way up to where they came to a barbed wire fence. They crossed into the field. I circumnavigated the field. I didn't want to go into somebody else's fence. Get shot of, maybe hit by a bull or something. And then I tracked it down to where I believe the creatures come out the woods. Based on the broke sticks and the trail. So now I'm following the trail. Through the woods where the creatures emerged. Here, on a daddy damn block. Also, if you watched my first video, I found a weird bone. A strange bone in the middle of the woods. No animal corcus, no nothing. Just a bone. So if you can identify that bone, please let me know in the comments below of the other video. It just looked weird. It looked almost human. But I'm not taking it with me. Because I'm already overloaded. As I follow this beat down, crept down trail through the woods. I'm halfway between Pelzer and Williamson, South Carolina. And if I'm really lucky today, maybe I'll get something on camera. I get really excited when I get on an investigation where it's only a couple hours old. Because that's in the realm of possibility that whatever made the tracks or whatever was seen may still be in the area. I'm scanning the trail. Hmm. Very interesting trail today. But it looks like it heads this way. Huh. As I follow these brussel up leaves. It rained really heavy. So everything is leaving an easy to follow path through the woods. But it's mostly mushed down, beat down stuff. I'm not getting no definitive sign. I could be following the trail of anything from a bear to a King Kong. If you see anything I miss, always be sure to let me know in the comments below. To my immediate left. I thought I heard a sound of what sounded like trees or sticks breaking. There's an old tarp in the woods. It's a very peculiar place in the middle of the woods for an old tarp to be laid. Shots in the distance. I see beer cans. An old tarp. And the remains of a shoe. Some old cans. I might be sorry I do this, but I've got to look under this thing. Ah! Uh, 
And that'll be all the looking under it I do. To build your ads. So YouTube, what do you think about this? An old campsite maybe? Let's carry on this trail. I've heard nothing else since the gunshots. And I'm still following the brussled up marks on the ground. I'm just not showing them because they don't show nothing. You know, we're obviously something traveled through here recently. Yeah, it's hard to tell what it was. Oh, goddamn. I about tripped and fell. <laughs> Maybe I should slow the fuck down. <laughs> I heard some really strange sounds just now. I wonder if that picked up on camera. I'm not sure what the fuck that was. Loud, growling, roaring. I wasn't so deep in the woods. I think it was a dragster. No. As I still see this beat down, messed up trail zigzagging off through the woods. I'm gonna stay, oh wow. Now look at this track. You can tell that's an imprintation of something. It looks almost canine-ish. Mm, that's interesting. I wonder if I'm on a dog man investigation and don't even know it. When he said large creatures in this area, I just assumed it was more than most likely a Sasquatch Bigfoot sighting. You know, a family of Bigfoots have been seen in this area many times. I've did reports on them. You can see them on here on the daily damn blog. At least whatever came through here was big enough that it broke the tops off these little bushes, bit over shit, and just kind of barreled ass through here like a monster-sized creature. Look, check out the ground. Huh. Does that show up? I don't know if that's going to show up or not, you two. It's just weird track. I can't get a good track. I can't tell what I'm tracking, but I'm tracking something. But I'm tracking on movement through the ground. I'm not tracking on sighted prints. And I prefer to track on prints. Uh-oh. This way. It took a turn to the left. It seems to be making a beeline back towards Crescent Hill Trail. If my instincts about where I am in the woods is correct. Even though I have never stepped foot on the land I'm on right now. It's a new thing to me. I love going places I've never been. <laughs> Seeing things I've never seen. Following trails I haven't been on. But I was in this area, I guess a few months back. I think it was in July, maybe, or June. On a bit, on an investigation, very similar for something that crossed the same road. And I actually had a rock that at me. You can see that video here. On the daddy damn block. As I track down this god awful hill. Following these set of footprints right here. Even though I can't tell what made them. This is Danny Staten here. On the daddy damn block. Tracking hairy creatures here in South Carolina. Unless something comes up, this will probably be the last video on this investigation. I may make one on the Danny Staten channel if you want to go over and check that out. As I always tend to make a few extra on that channel to keep a camera running. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. 
And be sure to enjoy me. Join me on my next investigation where I might actually see something. Until next time, I'm following that beat out trail through the woods to see what I can track down. This is Dennis Staten saying, Blog over, George. Blog over.